you guys finally got what you asked for. I'm finally making a caustic tips video. Um, this one's mainly just focusing on how to use traps when playing aggressive. That's about it. And this is just how I use caustic aggressive, but yeah, if you guys want me to do more vids like this, like more tip vids, like how to play good around cover with caustic, like how to, you know, use caustic this way, how to use caustic when playing defensive, you know, stuff like that, just let me know down in the comments and, you know, I'll try my best <laughs> to do it, you know, but yeah, anyways, uh, this Gibby is about to come up out in the open, um, you know, this one's kind of obvious, he's a free kill, basically, I gotta get loot, he doesn't, so, you know, I take the free kill, his teammate, I don't know if you saw him, but his teammate backed up around cover, so I was able to drop out without, um, you know, I was able to drop down without getting shot at. So even if his teammate did push me after I killed his teammate, I would have, uh, I would have had like a second to loot. And here I threw my trap behind the wall, so if his teammate did push me, he would either be at a big disadvantage by my gas, or it would make him back up. And here I'm going to throw my trap up in the room. That's very good to do. That's a very, very good thing you guys need to start doing. So uh, usually if I'm around cover, uh, I'll throw my trap in front of me or around the cover. So that way they would have either distract, they would have been distracted by my trap and they would have shot it out by the time I got there. Or they wouldn't shoot it out and it would be there as free cover in case I'm out in the open. Like here, I'm about to use it here. So I throw my trap out in the open right here, and, you know, this is a Mirage decoy, but... So that way I have free cover. You know, it's out in the open, I have free cover. I shot it, this guy pushes me, I'm in my gas, and then I rush out to kill him. So yeah, if there's not people around, always take your chances to throw a trap, you know, in front of you. Like, say if you're pushing someone, right? Uh, you know, you're behind cover, you're about to go around cover to where, you know, you're in their line of sight. Uh, throw your trap ahead of you so that way by the time you are in the, your line of sight you already have a trap in front of you and it's always best to put your trap next to you when healing or looting like here I uh, you know use my trap here to heal so if there's anyone on the other in the other direction where you know all they can see is my trap they can't see me and if they do see me they can't really shoot me all they can really shoot is my trap so yeah so basically uh, you know very uh, well, I'll, I'll explain this later here in just a second. So here, you know, this guy's out in the open. I'm behind cover. You know, easy kill, easy clip. And uh, here, I tried thirsting him, but I couldn't thirst him because I'm being shot in the back. But then I go for the thirst again. I throw the trap up in front of me next to the wall. And I thirst him, but his teammate pushes me. And here, this is when the trap uh, cover comes in. I, you know, he started shooting at me, I took cover behind the trap for one second, I wasted my gas nade, it's kind of stupid for me to do, I thought he was pushing me, but he was actually running away, so you know, here you go, got him here. Okay, so I'm about to push up in this house. It's got a lot of floors in it. This is a spot that's very good for caustics. This house up here that I'm about to go in, you guys will see. This is a very, very good spot for caustic to be fighting. But um, unfortunately here, my friend just joined the party and I wasn't really paying attention or listening or anything. So I ran into a whole squad, but I lasered two of them and they didn't even, you know, they, they got me really low, but luckily I got away. And I put my trap right next to the small piece of a cover, so that way, you know, I can shoot it, and the people on the other side of the small piece of cover, it makes it to where they basically can't push me, and they have a really small piece where they can shoot me, but they're probably not going to do that unless they have the digi threat. And on the other side of the tunnel, they can see me clearly, so I had to pay attention to that. And here my teammate got downed, I tried to res him out in the open, which was stupid, um, but then I realized that what I was doing was wrong, so instead I tried to punch him into cover, but we were being nade spammed, so, you know, I couldn't really do that. And so here, he got behind the cover, I placed my trap next to him, I, uh, you know, he's still getting nade spammed, I activated it and then rezzed him. So you see here, they can't cut me off, they can't really, you know, cancel me from rezzing, so he's up, and now I'm focusing the blood home. Because he's up by himself. His teammates are back there. For free easy kill. And here, I was trolling here. I don't know why I did this, but I placed my trap next to him. 
finished him, uh, you know, the guy that I was finishing ate all of his teammates' bullets, so, you know, somehow his teammate couldn't shoot me, even though, you know, I was in a clear line of sight of him, but, you know, not complaining, not complaining. And here, I push in. Uh, the zip line here, I place a trap right next to the zip line on the bottom, so that way, if I go up there and I laser someone, they decide to drop down there, they'll get hit by my gas and be slowed. So here, you know, this is just a little fight, no traps involved. And here, I place my trap uh, right there, so that way I can shoot it, and the people, you know, outside of my trap there can't really see us. Like, you know, uh, I'm holding the door, my trap doesn't have to do that, I can place my trap in front of me. So here, where this guy is, he could just kill us easily while we were healing there, but since I put my trap there, um, you know, he couldn't really do that, he couldn't really push us even if he wanted to. And here I place my trap again, I'm out in the open while healing, but this guy tries to jump on me and kill me, but instead my trap eats all of, my, all of his bullets, so I only take about like two shots while my trap takes the rest, and that causes him to die, because he couldn't really do damage on me while healing, and I got a free battery off and I had red armor. And here I heard footsteps, so I threw my, um, my trap up next to this door, and uh, you know, no one was really up there, so I just picked it back up. And here, I killed this caustic. Um, quick tip, it's very, very good to use other enemy caustic traps, um, you know, against them. So obviously if your teammates are next to it, uh, their traps, then, you know, it's better off to just shoot them out. But if you are fighting a, a caustic one-on-one, -on -one, it's just you two, and he has a trap next to him, you can use his trap as your own trap, if that makes sense. You know, like you're immune to the gas, so you can basically use his own trap as his cover, and you can use his own gas as your cover, you know, stuff like that. And here, I just nade my teammate to pick him up, because there's people above us. So that way I can, you know, get the res off pretty easily. Also got a trap next to him, just to block some bullets. And I go up here, this is an easy caustic 1v1. He didn't have any traps near him, and I have better aim than him, so, you know, it's just easy. And here, I go up to heal here behind this door. Uh, that's the same thing I did with the other door. I placed a trap where they could push me, and I held the door, so... You know, if they held the door, I could have shot my trap, or if they pushed the other way, I could have shot my trap. And they can't push me either way, and all they can do is shoot from a distance. Unless they have a digi threat, then they can, you know, laser you, but... Yeah, the, the lifeline rezzed, I go in for the caustic kill, uh, you know, while he's down, because his lifeline wasn't protecting him. And then there, I placed my trap next to me, and, you know, I activated it. And, you know, so that made it a bit hard for the lifeline to shoot me, and I placed my trap next to the lifeline while thirsting him, so I could get a, a quick armor swap. And, you know, I'd be have a little bit of protection. And here, I, you know, laser the Bloodhound for 94, almost crack him, go to the zipline. I use the zipline to dodge a bit of bullets, couldn't really hit him there very much there. My aim kind of bought it out. And I throw my trap out in the open, so that way he's, you know, he's, he's healing, right? I tried to shoot my trap, but it didn't activate for some reason. Like, it's very weird. I sprayed a whole, like half a mag into it, and it didn't activate. But, you know, basically... He's behind cover, he's healing, so I took my chance to throw my trap out in the open so I could activate it for me to have free cover and for me to have, you know, you know, I could push in further without, um, you know, much consequence because I can just back up in my gas if I get lasered, right? So, yeah. And yeah, another little thing I usually use, if I'm resing, looting a box, or resing someone, I place a trap near me, so if anyone decides to shoot me while I'm doing it, I can just quickly activate my trap and use it as cover. So there, you know, I'm safe. But obviously, if there's a whole squad shooting at you, that one trap isn't going to protect you from all three of them, because they're probably shooting at you uh, with different angles, so yeah. But it's still a good thing to use. So here, the Gibby went around cover, there was no point in shooting him, because I wouldn't have got that much damage off of him, but here the lifeline's out in the open, so I took, you know, my chance to get the free kill here. And he striked me, completely missed a strike. Here, I tried to slide down on the Gibby shield and throw my trap in. I was going to do my nade at first, but I changed my mind. But here, I threw my trap a bit too early, and it didn't manage to get inside the bubble. So, you know, that didn't really work out, but basically what I was trying to do, I was trying to throw my trap inside the bubble so that way it would force him out of the bubble, and I could use the bubble against him. But, you know, it didn't really matter. I got the lifeline down anyway. The Gibby ran away. I hit him really hard. I tried to push him, but he had a better position than me, and he had a hemlock. So if I fully pushed him on that zipline, he could have lasered me, 
and you know that would have been the end of it there and again I tried to shoot at him when he had was head glitching and he had a better weapon than me from that range he had a single tap hemlock and here uh, you know I get shot in the back so I move over here I throw a trap out in the open in front of me and heal so that way again I have protection if someone pushes me and here I get pushed in the back after I get done with my heal I hit the mirage a little bit and then I realize he has a teammate up on high ground, so I throw my, my nade on top of the Mirage so I can push in easily and kill the Mirage because he's focusing on leaving my gas than actually fighting me while I'm inside of it because that's a huge disadvantage. So not only am I in my gas and it blocks the, the enemy's view, like his teammate's view, so I can't really get lasered super hard by his teammates, but he either has a choice to fight me in his gas and probably fight me in my gas and probably lose or he can try and get out of the gas which never works honestly if you have a good caustic and here i throw my trap next to this piece of cover and try to heal but you know they can see the trap so they shot it out so i moved over here instead to throw my trap and heal so uh you can't hear the game audio but the gibby was rezzing my lifeline i killed so, you know, uh, he got out in the open, I got high ground, a uh, free kill there, because the enemies were shooting at him, so they cracked him for free. You know, the, you know, they basically gave me the free kill because they damaged him, he bubbled, and then he ran out the bubble, and I just got a few shots on him, and he's dead. So here, I couldn't find the lifeline, so I ended up just ignoring her and going to the better position, which is high ground inside circle. So if anyone did try to push us, uh, unless they have like a wraith portal or something, then chances are we would probably win. So here I'm kind of just looking around for them and stuff. Couldn't really see any, so I pushed up a bit more. So here, this um, Revenant decides to peek me. I have better aim than him. He's basically out in the open, so free kill there. His teammates didn't decide to peek and shoot me while I was a little bit low, so I took my chance to throw my trap out in the open. So it inflates all the way, so they can't shoot it out before it inflates. And that way I can use that trap as cover while healing out in the open. I don't have to move to a different piece of cover. And there, my teammate sniped him with the Kraber, so that's a free kill for me. Just three shots and he's down. So, yeah, guys, this is basically the end. Uh, hope you guys found this helpful. Hopefully, this might help you play a bit better with Caustic when playing aggressive. And, yeah. Uh, also, my Twitch link is in the description if you want to see some more live gameplays or, um, you know, me playing ranked. So, yeah, y'all have a great day, and uh, I'm out.